I saw a girl in a pub. That's nothing unusual in and of itself, but she had the kind of face that stands out from the crowd, like petals on a wet black bow in a station of the metro, but in a pub in Peterborough. I'd seen her here before, but I didn't dare to meet her right, so I just stared at the floor. I knew I had to talk to her, but what would I say? Do you come here often? What does that even mean? This is Peterborough, there's hardly much of a scene. Yes, there's some great new pubs, there's some I really love, but most people's drinking is done in one of two spoons. Before noon. So what can I say? I can't just pay her a compliment. I'm not that arrogant, I'm not American, I'm not even much of a man. And what would I tell her? I've been staring at your face for the best part of an hour. Ignoring all my mates to just steal glances at your face. They say go and talk to the girl. The worst thing she can do is say, I'm sorry, I'm not that interested in you. Well, I'm sorry. That sounds like the worst thing in the world. If I could handle rejection, do you think I would drink this much gin? <laughs> Point proven. <laughs> but finally, I find the confidence at the biting point between Dutch courage and Dutch dickhead to stumble over and mumble something like, Hi, I've seen you here before, and if it's quite all right with you, I'd like to see you more. I recognize you from the other side of the bar, and I've been dying to tell you just how beautiful you are. I took a breath and stilled myself to try and see it through. It shouldn't be this hard to say I like the look of you. And as I wait, make my way across the room with the weight of the world resting on my chest I look up and see that you've already left cheers Charles <laughs>